If you're selling products that are rather generic in nature and some private label owners making complaints about you, this video is entirely for you. Okay, another huge win by Brianna London from our team of paralegals. She's absolutely awesome. Here are some of the videos she's created to educate you on the issues that she's addressed. And she reported to me a great victory for an Amazon seller who was selling a product that was rather generic in nature. And this other seller started putting their private label on the product without any real changes to the product and then submitted a copyright complaint to Amazon knocking our seller out of the box. So seller reaches out, they speak to our killer client relations team, Marisol Lake, Jen McDonald, Nicole Goldberg. We take on the case because we think we can win. And so what do we do? We submit to Amazon what's called prior art. So what does that mean? That means that the product existed before they filed for their copyright protection. They didn't do anything new, it was already in the marketplace. And by pointing this out to Amazon, guess what? Our seller was reinstated. You can use this same tactic to go back to the complainant and say, hey, retract your complaint because your filing with the United States government is invalid because it existed before you filed it. You really don't own it. And that is often great leverage to get the complaint retracted. But in this particular case, Brianna decided to go straight to Amazon and she knocked it out of the ballpark with the very first plan of action she submitted. And that seller, as I'm shooting this video in our awesome new studio, has been reinstated, is making sales, making money in Q4 of 2021.